Las Vegas killers held extremist views. Two people who shot and killed two police officers and a bystander in the U.S. city of Las Vegas held extremist views, police have told U.S. media. A man and woman, who then killed themselves, left what appeared to be a manifesto at the scene, CNN reports. Witnesses told police the shooters said, this is a revolution during their attack. Las Vegas Mayor Carolyn Goodman called the killings a cruel act and praised the two officers. Alan Beck, 41, and Igor Saldo, 31, both husbands and fathers, were having lunch in a pizza cafe at 11.30 18.30 GMT on Sunday, when they came under attack. A man and a woman shot them dead before moving on to a Walmart shop nearby and shooting another person. The rampage ended when the woman fatally shot the man and then herself. Police have not officially indicated what the motive could be, but the Las Vegas Review-Journal has reported that police found swastika symbols in the apartment. And neighbors of the couple, reportedly married, told the paper the two had a reputation for spouting racist, anti-government views. Witnesses said the two entered the pizza cafe shouted this is a revolution and shot at the police officers. One of the officers managed to return fire, but it was unclear if the shots hit the pair. Inside the Walmart, Las Vegas police called to the scene exchanged fire with the suspects. Beck, who was a father to three, had been with the police department since 2001. Saldo joined the Las Vegas police in 2006, and leaves behind a wife and baby, police told reporters. His sister-in-law, Colleen Saldo, described him as a great guy who previously worked as a corrections officer.